Hello everybody, welcome back to The Breakdown. I'm Tone, it is fantastic uh, to have you joining me on my channel once again. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, even though both of those things have well and truly passed us by. We're almost a month past Christmas and um, we're very fast closing into the end of the first month of the year, as crazy as that is. Um, so apologies that I didn't get a Christmas message or a New Year's message out uh, around that time. It was an incredibly busy time for me, as I'm sure it was an incre uh, incredibly to uh, busy time for you as well. Um, but uh, yeah, I hope you had a lot of fun with family, um, with friends. Um, perhaps you got to travel a little bit. Um, I hope that you got some things that you were hoping to get on your Christmas list. Um, and um, I just want to, I guess, sort of do a little bit of reflection on last year and have a bit of a look forward into this year. Um, now, if you've been following my channel um, for any real great length of time, um, in particular, perhaps since I started the channel, you'll know that uh, uh, the inflationary thing was not something that was unforeseen. It was always coming. Um, and uh, we're now sort of, in my opinion, getting towards the point of perhaps this year um, some interest rate cuts. Now, don't hold me to that just as you know, you couldn't necessarily hold me to my predictions about the interest rates going up as hard as they did. Um, although, they went harder than I thought they were going to as well. Um, I thought that we might have been um, looking into this year, excuse me, to be getting towards that 4.5%. Well, they well and truly got that sorted last year. So, uh, but I am expecting the possibility of interest rate cuts this year. Because they've already got the effect they wanted to get um, out of it to a great degree. Um, again, we don't hear about um, housing loan defaults and delinquencies or whatever. We don't hear about that. There's been enough of it going on. Um, you hear stuff uh, on the radio. They'll say, you know, they'd have some bank expert on there going, banks don't want that to occur. They can't really, you know, absorb that. Blah blah blah. That's rubbish. Uh, <clears throat> now, um, what else did we have last year? Well, we had um, a weather guy that I follow. Um, he got my attention when he predicted the flooding in the end of 22, towards the end of 22. Predicted that flooding was coming a month or two out, at least from what I could tell. He might have been predicting it further before that. Um, and then, you know people died um, uh, from a lack of preparation because pretty much everybody was following, you know, the the um, or the, the mass media version of weather forecasting. Now, how did that play out for, you know, the farmers and that uh, last year? Well, we were looking at an El Nino, weren't we? <laughs> an El Nino. Uh, you know, I, I wasn't listening to the... Um, the wider, you know, like the BOM, for example, the the um, Bureau of Meteorology. I wasn't listening to anything they had to say all through last year after they really royally screwed it up in 22. And, of course, what did they do? Well, they went even further into screwing it up in 23. Because, well, what happened? We got to November and the heavens opened up and places just got smashed with flooding rains but El Nino right so this year um, I would suggest to you go and check out AV weather on Facebook and you'll be able to find the link there to if you want to subscribe subscribe now I am not affiliated with him even though I share the same first name Anthony um, he wouldn't know me from a bar of soap um, although I guess he knows I don't look like a bar of soap, but he doesn't know me. 
Um, he's only seen a couple of posts or comments or whatever that I've sort of put on uh, some of his material. Uh, but I've, I definitely uh, advise, that's, this is advice, uh, go and at least seek his material out and check for yourself. But I had no doubt, I, will, I, I had full faith in his forecasting ability for 23 and it did not let me down. Now I did try to share that um, with some people closest to me um, and uh, well, I had a go. I mean, I, I, the same sort of stuff I try to, to, you know, do, you know, in, in sharing things and that during um, C19 days. And well, that didn't go down so good either. But by sharing it and all the things that have come out since, people are waking up to what happened to them back then and I'm hoping that perhaps maybe this coming year there'll be a little bit more listening to me uh, if I bring some topics that AV or Anthony um, has been talking about for the weather this year based on the fact that well he was on the money last year uh, so um, yeah there's there's a lot of stuff that's potentially coming this year um, and uh, I'm going to delve into that in some some videos that come after this one in, in the next little while. Um, I do want to try to get some more videos out this year uh, a little bit more frequently. Um, there's so much to cover. Uh, it's just finding the time to do it. But um, I, I think it's well worth my time doing it. Uh, and I'm praying that it'll be of benefit to those that of those of you that come to watch these videos uh, but I'm going to leave it there uh, I'm running out of space on the recording device once again because I haven't cleared data off of it but um, look above all uh, I pray that you will have a prosperous uh, year in 2024 I pray that you will be eyes open ears open you know and really absorbing what you're you know hearing analyze what you're hearing don't just take it as gospel critical thinking is huge and it's also not encouraged much these days but i encourage you 100 percent to be critically thinking through everything because we should not allow some of the stuff that's been done to us in the last few years to be done again and they are still pushing for so many things. But like I said, we can cover that in some videos coming later. But um, if you can find people that have been getting things consistently right against the narrative, they're the people to listen to. So until next time, I'll see you in the next videos. Take care and God bless you.